Today I have the pleasure of speaking with Brendan Grunewald from Movely Media. How are you today, Brendan? I'm very well, thank you, Tracy. Since COVID-19, your stock has doubled. Now, I think a lot of people are appreciating what you offer right now, but can you tell us why you have, imp you have been impacted so positively? Well, I think, um, look, nobody wants a pandemic. Nobody wishes this on anybody, and certainly it's, you know, there, there are, it's impacting people's lives. The, the biggest factor here is it's changed the way people have, are being forced to work, to, to learn, and just the way that people have to communicate. You know, the, the physical meetings have just evaporated. And so we need tools that, that we can communicate effectively with, uh, and video is, 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 uh, is a great way to communicate. You know, if a picture is worth a thousand words, a video is worth a million. And of course, Movely Media has had a steady flow of news recently. I loved your government. Uh, what, you had a government extension for with your contract for another three years. Is that correct? Yeah, I think yes, we have, and uh, I think very proudly. What we're seeing um, is that the increased awareness as people start looking for tools like ourselves is causing a lot of companies, particularly large companies, to look at us afresh. But also, what's really pleasing is a lot of our existing customers have been with us for years and made thousands of videos uh, on their particular topic, whether that be for internal communications uh, or, or external promotional materials, uh, that they are coming back to us and extending their, their contracts with us. And that, for me, that to me means we're delivering great value to our customers. Well, speaking of great value, we at Investor Intel all have professional memberships from Movely Media. We love the technology, so we can answer this question, but obviously our audience wants to hear your answer. Can you provide us with why the Movely Media professional you know, uh, technology is so competitive compared with others? Well, I think what we're seeing, certainly, this is, this is a fairly interesting space. There are a number of players in it. What we've really stri strive to do is what we call democratize the access or the ability to make really high-end quality content. Uh, so our strive is always to make it very, very simple to use, but at the same time offer a wide variety of different solutions. So if you're someone who just wants to make a quick social media video, you can do that within seconds on our, or using our templates. Uh, conversely, if you're an, an uh, experienced videographer and you really want to knock the park out, then you know you can you can use some of our advanced features like green screening and screen recordings and you know uh, we've also got automa automated subtitling um, that brings me to the second USB which I would say is our automator increasingly we're seeing companies want to make vast volumes of content and they want to do that using programs or spreadsheets where they import that data and mass personalize and customize uh, videos so that I would say is the second big uh, push that we have. And I think thirdly, uh, the, the fact that we are um, have an exceptionally good uh, price offering makes us very competitive in the market for in terms of value for money. Well, how are you dealing with your growth challenges, Brendan? Well, I think, you know, we've got a great team. That, 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 it all comes down to a great team. You know, without the, the right resources, we have the right commitment. And even through this, this pandemic, you know, we had to shut our offices, but that didn't stop people working uh, probably even harder because they were at home uh, making sure that this, you know, we, we deliver what we need to. So I think it starts it starts with a, uh, with, a, with, a, with, a, with a good team. So what should shareholders anticipate, say, in this upcoming quarter or two? Well, you know, I wish, you know, I wish uh, things were regular and you could say, well, you know what, we're going to have something to announce every month. I think that would, the market would appreciate that too. But what we see is things happen in spurts. You know, you'll have a couple of months where you're working on things and, and there's not anything necessary to announce. You know, we're now seeing a lot of the work that we've done in the course of the this year come to fruition. So I think, uh, you know, keep watching out for, for our press releases and our announcements. And I'm pretty confident that uh, going forward, there'll be a few more. And, you know, our, our focus is very, very much on, on, on driving that value to customers. And I'm, I must say, you know, I, I think it's very heartwarming to the to ourselves as as founders and our our staff that uh, finally also the market is starting to appreciate some of the work that we're doing in in terms of the the share price as well. Well, again, Brendan, thank you so much for the update, and let's have you on more regularly.
It would be my great pleasure. Thank you for the invitation.